Hi, Communication Studies students. My name is Stephanie Rosenblatt, and I'm one of the librarians here at Cerritos College. I'm also the librarian that's been assigned to your class, so I wanted to take a second to introduce myself so you would have a face that goes with any of the emails or announcements that I'll be sending you this semester. I also wanted to make sure that you knew how to get help from the library and how to access our resources for the projects that you're starting to work on right now. So let me show you how to get to the library's homepage. Right now I'm looking at the college's homepage, www.cerritos.edu. If we click on Quick Links and then Library and Chat, we'll go to the library's homepage. The first thing I want to point out to you is this link here on the right hand side of the screen that says chat with a librarian. If you click that and then start a chat, you'll be immediately connected to a real life human being, a professional librarian, and that person can help you with whatever you need. We have someone staffing our chat from 730 in the morning until 10 o'clock at night, Monday through Thursday, 730 until 3 on Friday and 10 to 3 on Saturdays. In the announcement where I send you this video, I'll also tell you how you can make an appointment with me you know, by emailing in advance, and you can mostly find me on chat on Friday afternoon. But if you only have time to work on your stuff at 9 o'clock at night on a Thursday, then don't wait for me. Start your work and come here and chat with one of my colleagues and we'll help you out, okay? Now, there are a couple of resources that I thought might be really helpful for you based on what's in your syllabus right now, and I want to show them to you so you could get started using them. They're research databases, so to get to them, I'm going to click on the research databases link. The first one I'll show you is called Opposing Viewpoints in Context. So what we're looking at right now is an alphabetical list of all of our databases. If I go down to O, we'll get to Opposing Viewpoints. And it tells you what it is. It's like a, a source to investigate hot topics, social issues. It, it's kind of a one-stop shop. I'm going to click on the title. And if you do that at your house, you're probably going to be asked for a username and password. And what you would do is you would just put in the same username and password that you use to get into Canvas. Once you're here, you can just do a simple search for a topic. But if you don't know what you want to write about, this, this resource is great because you can click this little link here that says Browse Issues, and it will give you a lot of ideas about what you want to write about, right? So sometimes it's a good place to kind of get started if you don't have any ideas. If you do know what you want to write about or you're interested in investigating, you can just put in a simple keyword search. So in this situation, I'll just put in video games. And then you'll get back a bunch of different kinds of information on that topic that you can use to start to construct your argument. And I'll send you some videos later that show you how to really use this resource in all of its ways. But I have a feeling that if you poke around in here, you're going to kind of get how it works. But I'll give you some more help later. The other resource that I want to show you is further down this um, alphabetical list, and it is called U.S. Major Dailies. And what it is, is it's a collection of the 21 major U.S. newspapers. This is a great place to um, get information about what's going on right now. So, you know, I'd done a search earlier for a different class on the Ukraine because of what's happening there. Um, I could do something on, I could also do something on video games, right? That's what I'm into. get over 260,000 results, and, and I can limit by all kinds of things. I can limit to the type of item. I can limit to publication date. So if I just want to know what's happening in the last year or so. But you can see, like, once you're in here, you have access to the Washington Post, the New York Times, uh, the Wall Street Journal, all kinds of major papers in the United States. So I hope those resources help you get started. I hope that you'll remember how to get to the library's homepage so you can get help from me or one of my colleagues immediately when you need it. And I look forward to talking to you more this semester. Good luck.